What's up everybody? Happy Earth Day. We're out here getting the garden all situated. Um, so as you can see, I got this big line of pots behind me and those are root pouches. Um, and those are 10 gallon size. And originally the plan was to uh, grow some tomatoes in there, but obviously we can't plant tomatoes out since we got about another month of uh, frost potential. Um, so what I've done is we went down the middle of each one and kind of alternated. So one has a head of lettuce, one has the head of cabbage in the middle, and then the other one, what else did we put in the middle there? I think it was just cabbage, lettuce, and then uh, we went around the outside and then alternated with between carrots, spinach, and Swiss chard. Um, so at the very least, it should be a really, you know, aesthetically pleasing uh, setup along the uh, fence here. And then as we go down, um, obviously we got the garlic and everything here. And then we got some other raised bed, uh, and these are actually fabric pots as well. Um, so we got some spinach and lettuce and Swiss chard in the big one here. And then this other one we got kale, but uh, it looks like it's not doing so hot. So I might have taken a little bit of a chance on uh, planting that out too early. And it got frosty, frozen the, that same night. So that's uh, my fault and I uh, kind of pissed at myself and wasted like a whole tray of kale. But that's the whole name, name of the game with gardening. You just kind of learn and grow. Uh, as a person when you don't actually get to grow shit. So, um, so I just want to take you down the line too. Just here's some other things that we've got. There's Kyla doing some work over there. And uh, forgive me for going all over the place here. Um, but as you can see here, we've got some raspberries and they're doing pretty swell. <laughs> so I'm trying to, try to get like a creative view here. So, as you can see, it's flowering all, or not flowering, but starting to grow all along the uh, stem there. And then we've also got our blackberries that are doing the same thing. So, um, worried about the blackberry because I thought I chopped it up. But, as you can see, the fruiting laterals are doing just fine. And it uh, looks like some flowers are getting ready to burst on that, too. Um, so, coming down the line, got some raspberries. This one's looking really good. Guy. There's the whole fam. So these are uh, red raspberries that I just took you through, and then this one right here is the golden raspberry bush. Um, and the variety is called Ann. This might be double Ann. I don't know if that's a thing for real or not, but that's what we got growing there. Then we've got another bed that we're going to be planting up we're not really sure yet probably throw the tomatoes down there um, and then fill the middle with like peppers and then we've got this bed that we're working on um, and we're going to start off probably early with like lettuce and um, carrots and just some of those you know early early season consumables and then flip it over to herbs as we get into the season so um, i'm going to get back to planting and gardening and helping kyla out just wanted to give you guys the update and that's what we're doing on this earth day so hope you're able to get outside um, enjoy the day and uh, plant something for mother earth um, so <laughs> hope you guys have a great day um, and don't forget there's also a lot of garage sales out there so uh, that'll be good for the flip challenge and making a little extra cash too so thanks for tuning in as always i appreciate it